and welcome to a new video. So today I have a newborn girl coming into the studio with her older sister and her parents. I want to test uh, an app for like a white noise machine. I do see that my phone battery is really low so I need to get my charger. Um, they have it for Android because I have an Android phone, Samsung, uh, but they also have it for Apple. Normally I use the baby shusher which has this sound. Today I want to use this one, I want to test it. I have a hair dryer, I have hush, I have sh I have a vacuum cleaner, I have the womb, and then tons of other sounds. So let's uh, go. Well, this is a hair dryer. You can play, pause, listen, duration, 30 minutes, volume, you can change everything. So let's go to the sh. Ooh. That's aggressive. Uh, let's go to the womb. Can you hear? Okay, first I'm going to get my charger and then I'm going to see which one we're going to use today. And if it doesn't work, I'll still use the baby shusher. Okay, so let's go. I have my phone on the charger, which I mean, it's not ideal, I think, to play it on your phone. But also, sometimes these ones are not available. I mean, I've been using the same one for eight years, but Everybody has a phone and an iPad. Uh, so this app actually contacted me if I wanted to test it. It's called the Sound Sleeper app. And it's supposed to be really popular and working really well for newborns to sleep. Okay, they say they have over 5 million downloads with an average rating of 4.8 stars. So it should be pretty good. Okay, so I do have a discount code for you. It is Fena, so it's just my name. And with this code, uh, you'll be able to get two weeks for free of the premium version of the Sound Sleeper on iOS. Normally it would be like $7 a month. You can try it out. Um, okay, so let's go to the app. So let's go to the hair dryer. Okay, I have the volume at 60 and you can choose the duration, you can say pause, play or listen. Oh, okay, no, then you're going to record audio. Okay, then we have the hush. A bit aggressive. Okay. I don't think that works. Let's go. This is the shh sound. in between the shh and it's quite aggressive as well uh, it's a vacuum cleaner okay it does sound like a vacuum cleaner and then we've got the womb sound And then you have a lot more. Uh, best for infants can be a car ride, fan, mountain, river, rain. Best for toddler, toddlers can be a market, an ocean, a pond. Best for parents, a bubbling brook, a fireplace, a seashore, or a thunderstorm. Can I record video while I have this sound on? Probably not. Oh, I can. It starts, it continues uh, the sound even though I'm like recording video on my phone now. That's interesting. So it kind of like plays in the background. Who knows? I might use this one today. We'll see. And then I'll give you my opinion on how it works on the baby. Of course, I can't really judge it by using it on one baby. But I thought I would let you know that this app exists. And just um, let you listen to the sounds. And I'm gonna continue just waiting for the clients to come. Yeah, I thought I'd show you a uh, pullback. So here is my uh, Westcott 15 softbox. It has a speed light inside. I'm still charging the battery. Um, I have my 24 to 70 millimeter lens aperture 2.8. I have here a little outfit. Yeah, my phone I can place there. Um, and yeah, this can be like a decor for the parent shot. 
And yeah, the parents can sit during the session and the uh, older sister. And then here I have another decor. I'm gonna put my battery in my flash in a second in my speed lights. Welcome sign. Um, so yeah, and then uh, of course some more outfits. And I have some toys here for the sibling. I pretty much never show you this because it looks a little bit messy, but more stuff. Kitchen, nothing special. Um, so yeah. Heater on and I have the warm sound on on my phone. Not too loud, but it's there. Um, the baby's 10 days old today. She was born after her due date. So, um, yeah. She can have one of those days where she wants to drink a little bit more um, because that can happen around the 10th day. But because she was born like five days after her due date, it's also very likely that she already had that day. Um, but otherwise, we'll just take a few more breaks so she can um, have her drinks and her snacks and uh, then we'll continue. I have a headband here. I have um, always two stretch wraps and one non-stretchy wrap so I can like wrap the baby and the non-stretchy one is maybe to cover the baby when she's lying on the head on hands position. Um, so yeah, this is the sound that they will be hearing. I quite like it. And if it gets annoying or it doesn't work, I'll switch back to my baby shusher. I think this is a good alternative. Alright. Especially if the baby shusher is not available in your country, this app you can download wherever. Okay, so I just realized I ripped my pants this morning. Here. My clients can be here any second, so I'm not gonna change now. But this is typically me. I felt that I was like got stuck on like uh, the handle of the door. It actually ripped here and I like these pens and I have to order new ones and I can fix it of course this is so me now I saw it in the mirror I can pull my shirt down <laughs> okay clumsy me Wat je al op vakantie met papa en mama? Met je zus. Dat is leuk. Even heeft ze gehad. Oh ja. En heb je straks ook nog iets nodig om haar te kunnen voeden? Of... Ik 
Nou, je bleef lang. Ik weet dat ik een wijntje zet. Dan mag je niet met het voorhoofd zo maar tegen Oh. Oh. Okay, so I still have the sound on. Uh, we just finished the session. Lovely baby girl, lovely big sister, lovely family. Uh, she was wide awake, big eyes looking into the camera. She was sleeping for a little bit. Um, it, it was like helping her maybe to fall asleep this sound because uh, of course she also got a feeding which also helps i can never really tell if this was doing the magic trick or just the milk or just uh being here my calming presence the warmth just being a baby and wanting to sleep i don't know what it was uh but i had it on and it's not super annoying it's okay uh will i use it more often yeah maybe uh, i also have my baby shusha which i also like so maybe if I have my baby shush on and it's not working, baby's still really uh, like fussy, restless, I don't know, I can always turn it off and then maybe turn this one on and see if that works. Maybe different sounds work for different babies. Uh, this one shuts off automatically either after 15 minutes or after 30 minutes. This one, uh, you can have it on forever or for like two hours. So maybe you can keep track of time if your session is two hours. Well, hello. Today, well, I just finished the Kixma session like an hour ago. Uh, cleaned up everything and now I'm waiting for a newborn girl to come in. So yeah, we'll be using that um, and then I'll show you if it worked. And otherwise I can use my baby shusher. The table will be vibrating a little bit as well because it's a Paloma Shell ET table, so... I don't know what helps the baby to sleep. It can be one of those things. It can be all combined. The sound, the heater, the vibration of the table. I don't know. But this is the sound for today. Oh, this is very nice. Sorry, I'm going Of course, my camera battery died, so you can only see the first half where the baby was a little bit restless. I'm just going to turn off the sound now because um, baby is not here anymore. They just left. Where is it? Pause. So it was actually interesting. Uh, so yeah, I couldn't film her anymore, but I've got photos to prove to you that she fell asleep and I could pose her in the bum up position and the head on hands position. But yeah, she was quite... Um, uh, restless at the beginning well she was a little bit upset at the beginning of the session she had some tummy pain and she also had at home tomorrow they were gonna go to see the doctor again because she was hardly sleeping at home um, also during the night and you could just feel her tummy moving almost and she had like lots of gas and stuff so uh, the mom actually told me that at home they also had like a white noise machine that she used um it wasn't really working that well but it was like the shushing sound so i started off with the baby shusher but it wasn't really working that well um it could be a number of things of course because also maybe she wanted to drink something but anyway i changed to this sound of this app with the heartbeat and everything and she did calm down uh, also after feeding which of course also contributes to having a calm and happy baby usually but um, so we changed to the app and then we listened to that sound for like two hours. Um, so it's great to have options to have multiple sounds maybe to see if 
what works for which babe. So check it out, use my uh, discount code FENA, FENA for some premium time on the app. Um, and you can try out different sounds and see if you like that. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, have a lovely day and um, maybe I'll see you in